Aya, Napa, Aya, fucking Napa, Aya, Napa, Aya, fucking Napa, Aya, Napa, Aya, fucking Napa. Is this thing on? Welcome back to Big Mouth and fancy seeing you here in Jew. Are very welcome, my friends, and especially my enemies. Come in, sit down, no touching. I don't do the touching, but I'll do some kissing. Maybe not, because a kiss is a deal breaker. Welcome to tonight's Love Island reaction. It's Friday night, and drinking's got to be done. And in a way, I feel sorry for you one day because she's clearly not had many experiences with men. But that moment when she sits on Danny's lap is the most embarrassing, cringy moment. If you want to mark your territory, sweetheart, either piss in his face or kiss him. Kiss him, sweetheart. But what you did was embarrassing, cringy, and you're... Playing into Arabella's hands, you you really are. Um, Arabella is a shit-stirring bitch. I'm not just going to go for a single guy because he's single. No, you're going to go for a, an attached guy because he's attached, you fucking minger. She's absolutely ghastly. And second of all, she's not even all that. And then she shit-stirs. She has a chat with you one day. Then... And she stirs it up and makes Danny look like a prick, right? Then, when she pulls him for a chat, she admits to him that she shit-stirred in his face then. I think at that moment, he knew what kind of girl this is. And apparently, apparently, he's mates with Charlie, for, who, who's her boyfriend, who's been on Love Island. So this is the gift that keeps on giving. But, in a way, I think Ant... Anton is getting away with murder here because getting involved with her is poisonous. I think Ant is just enjoying his experience for someone who keeps on being rejected. I think he's taking it really, really well. Um, but absolutely cringy and embarrassing. I loved the kissing competition. It was hilarious. Watching Amy meltdown was brilliant. But these producers have decided they want to protect um, Curtis and Amy's relationship so they contrived that stupid date they wasted 10 minutes of the final part of the episode on those boring people but it was hilarious and Curtis apologizing look the guy's a drip there's no question about it Curtis is a freaking drip and I didn't want to watch that but they made up for it with that chat between you one day and Arab, Arabella in the end, but you can see that, you know, this girl Arabella is, is she, she, look, I don't even think she really fancies Danny, she's the type of girl who just likes using her power, you know, stirring it up, and then walking away, and watching the, the explosion, she's not really someone you want to get involved with, I mean, this is someone, apparently, who has got a boyfriend, who didn't even tell him she was coming on the show. So, and I mean, he's writing, he's writing stuff on Twitter and taking screenshots. Just dump her, mate. Just dump her. She's, she's not someone you want to be around. Kissing's a deal breaker, is it? These people are batshit fucking crazy, right? You judge me on a fucking kiss. You dump me on a kiss. You tell me you're not going to date me because I'm a crap kisser. And maybe I am. I don't know, right? You'll have to ask all the girls I'll fucking kiss, right? But, you know, ridiculous. Because once somebody says a kiss is a deal breaker, bye-bye. Go away, sweetheart. Oh, honestly, right? She, I mean, Danny hasn't got much of a choice when it's recoupling, but I think it's the girl's turn to choose, which makes things really interesting because it's all about who gets to choose first, really. So are they going to allow Arabella to choose first or are they going to allow Yawande to choose first? It, it's very, very interesting. At this point, I feel sorry for Danny so much. I wish someone else could choose him, but this is not how Love Island works. It's either Arabella or it's either Yawande. And how this works is going to be very interesting unless they put a spin on recoupling. Um, it's all about who gets to choose 
Danny first. If he ends up with Arabella, he's fucked. His whole experience is fucked. She's not interested in him. She's just, look, she is a super badge. I mean, she makes um, Amy look like um, a, a choir girl, doesn't she? she? She's absolutely ghastly. But I want, you, I want you to tell me what you think of tonight's episode because I just ended up feeling sorry for Danny because whoever chooses him, He's fucking screwed. I'll see you tomorrow for tomorrow's reaction. Oh no! I may do some Love Island videos, but there's no Love Island. Those stupid other bits, right, that I never watch, right? So I shall see you on Sunday, unless I think of a Love Island video to do. But I shall see you in the next video. Have a nice evening, because I can assure you, I am Iron Appa. Here we come. Fucking Iron Appa.